Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the world of Rakugo. My name is Taiga Tenyankichi, and I'm very grateful for you watching my Rakugo. Rakugo has become popular in the world now, but I think not so many people have really seen it. Let me remind you, in Rakugo stories, many stories start like this. I bend my head to this side and say, Oh, hello, hello. This is just one of the characters saying hello to the other character in the story, so you don't need to answer. Then I bend my head to the other side and say, Oh, hey, it's you. Why don't you come up here? You know what to do, right? Stay where you are. Don't come up on stage just because I say so. So the Rakugo stories consist of conversation. There are many characters in the story and they have conversation between them. And that's how you watch it, but still you have to use your imagination. Now let's practice using your imagination. It's quite simple. Imagine that I have an apple in my hand. I'm going to throw it to you and I want you to catch it and throw it back to me, okay? Hey, take it! Ah, <laughs> are you all sleeping? <laughs> Catch the apple, I told you! <laughs> I'll try it again. Hey! Okay, everyone has caught apple this time. You, please throw apple to me. Come on! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, next thing is, uh, how about a butterfly? Imagine one butterfly is flying from this side to the other side, okay? That is a butterfly. Look, a butterfly. Okay, <laughs> next thing is uh, how about a little cat? She's washing her face. Okay, <laughs> you may think how foolish I am. Well, this is what we do on the stage. Okay, it's time to do a Rakugo. You know Rakugo? We have all kinds of stories. For example, this story came from an American joke. One day, Mike burst into the living room. Dad! Mom! I have some great news for you. I'm getting married to Maria next door. She's so pretty and I proposed to her three times. Finally, she said, yes, I'm so happy. After dinner, dad took him aside and said, Sam, I have to talk to you. Your mom is a wonderful wife and mother. But while she was pregnant, she suffered from nurse's pregnancy and refused sex with me. I was so shocked. I'm beyond seeing Maria's mother sometimes. Maria is your sister, so you can't marry her. Sorry, but don't tell Ma about this, okay? Dad, I'm crazy for her. What should I do? Sorry, son. Forget it. It can't be helped. Mike was enraged. He finally decided to go to his mother with this news. Mom, Mom, Dad has done so much harm. He said, I can't get married to Maria. Why? He said, she's my sister. <laughs> Don't pay any attention to what he says. You can marry her. But she's my sister. Well, 
He may be Maria's father, but he's not your dad. 